morning. Mornings are rough, but especially this week. I normally like to do my reset routine on a Monday, get myself sorted and prepare for the week, but that did not happen this week. I had a big project that I finished on Monday, and then yesterday I slept in until 11 a.m. Everything feels a bit everywhere. My brain feels so unsettled because of it. So it is time for a midweek reset. I always regret it if I don't do some sort of morning movement. So let's do it. morning drink. We have ginger, lemon, apple cider vinegar, and honey. Cheers. Oof, she's strong. I feel health and energy from this drink. So the reason why I feel like everything is a bit of a shambles and the reason why I haven't actually posted in a couple of weeks is because I just finished a big work project that I had on. So I was actually working with a company on an education video. So overall, I had 110 songs that I had to film. So this was learning the dance and lyrics to all these different songs. So the project actually only lasted one week, but as you can imagine, there was so much prep that I did leading up to filming all of these songs. So literally every spare second I had, I was practicing whenever I had my headphones on, I was listening to the songs. And that is why I feel like my brain just turned into mush. So it was a super fun project to put it in the nicer term. I now need to get my stuff sorted. So thank you for being here. You're helping me feel motivated. And in turn, I hope I can help you feel motivated too. We've got a lot of stuff to get sorted. But first, can I just show you my new loungewear set? I mean, I'm here for the pink. You know, this might actually be pajamas, but I'm wearing it as my new home loungewear. I love to just feel cozy and snug. And the fact that it was pink, I was like, this is for me. This is exactly what I was wanting. I'm ready for home organization. Let's do this. <laughs> that I do do is my breakfast and right now I'm in a baked oatmeal phase I literally just throw everything into this blender all the seeds fruits all the goodness I can fit in and blend it up and we're good So this is what we got, so delicious, so easy to make, and it saves me so much time in the morning. So for me, this is definitely worth doing. You may think this is weird, but I absolutely love folding clothes, making them into very neat little shapes and then placing them into their own little spots in the cupboards or drawers or whatever. I find it so, Therapeutic. Is this a star sign thing? Because I feel like I've seen a lot of other creators who are also Virgos kind of saying the same thing, so maybe it's that. But if you don't enjoy doing it, I would recommend either putting on music or a podcast. I personally love listening to podcasts while doing stuff like this. It just, I feel like I'm feeding my mind while also being productive. If I can give you one tip, it is to buy a handheld vacuum. This thing is incredible. As an adult, you have to dust literally every day. I don't know how so much dust can accumulate, but it does. So this helps me so much. Like where does this dust come from? Oh, seriously. When it comes to cleaning 
products, I actually like to make my own. So this is my all-purpose spray, which is so easy to make. So this is just Castile soap, water, and then I just added some lemon essential oils. We're good to go. I love homemade goodies. a nice halibong from Jeju. And then these are tuna rice balls. I don't think I've actually ever tried making these before, but this is like my favorite kind of thing. Tuna mayo. I actually made it with Greek yogurt. Tuna yogurt, rice, seaweed. Not bad. Mm. feels so clean. It smells so fresh. Let me tell you a little unfun truth about living in Korea. I think this applies to like the older areas more specifically, but because of the older systems, it smells like sewage a lot. On the streets mainly while you're walking around in some areas, but then sometimes that comes into your house as well, which is not the nicest. So having it smell nice and fresh in here is so important to me. I'm sure you understand why. It is so true when they say a clean house means a clear mind. I feel so good right now. So I'm gonna get out on a little afternoon walk and get some groceries and just some little bits while I'm out. Good wholemeal bread, ginger for my morning drinks, sogenbang, I am obsessed with this salt bread at the moment, some toothbrushes for cleaning, double-sided tape because there's some things that are falling apart that I need to put back together with this. Going to Daiso especially, I really have to hold myself back. There are so many organizational things that I want to buy for the house. I'm not going to, however, for good reason. We are actually moving later this year. I think in August our lease runs out here and we're going to be heading somewhere else, which I'm so excited to move and set up a new space. So I'm also excited for the videos to come with that as well there's going to be a whole apartment hunting series and decorating the new place but that's all in a few months but for now i'm just trying to keep the space nice but not buy anything more specific for here because we can do a lot of that later on i currently have my schedule up on notion for my content i need to get organized a little bit. I feel like I've kind of lost a bit of my routines the last few weeks. Once I get on top of my routines again, I'm gonna feel good and kind of more back into the grind. There's exciting stuff coming up though, so I'm so looking forward to this year. Also, I absolutely loved all your comments on the last video as well. I just feel like everyone was full of so much positivity. It really shone through and the building of like our little community is something that I love, so please continue commenting. I love to read your thoughts on what you've been up to as well. I hope the start of your year has has been great so far. And if it hasn't gone the way you planned, you can do your own little refresh anytime, like a midweek one like I'm doing this week. After today, I feel so motivated and just ready to get back in stuff. So I hope I have given you some motivation as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.